Christmas is here with us again. It is not merrymaking in the sense of eating, drinking, enjoying ourselves, moving around, exchanging gifts, but it is a period for us to sit down and meditate carefully on why Christmas? What makes it so special and unique? This year, I have discovered three things that I shared with you. The first is God willingly became man. He took upon himself all our weaknesses, our limitations. Despite the fact that he is God and all powerful, he laid his power back, took only love and descended on earth to become a human being, limited to time and space. And so Christmas will remember the time when God willingly became man. We should also learn this aspect of God. We can become, we cannot be, be God, neither can we play God. But the mere fact that he gave that others may have and live, we must also learn to do the same thing, give our very best make society better. Second thing is, the angel said, he brought peace and goodwill to all mankind. Why is there so many disturbances and violence in this world? Because of greed and selfishness and pride. Not wanting others to have part of national cake. We want to have it all to ourselves. But that's not the uh, idea why God came. He came with love. All mankind. The Bible tells us, For he loved the world so much so that he gave himself, that all who would believe in him would not perish, have a lasting life. So we must learn to love. Third is, if Christmas will be meaningful, we must also learn to live in peace with one another. We must learn to be content with our lot. We must learn to respect one another. We must learn to complement one another. We must learn to encourage one another. These are very few out of the things I plan to share with friends this Christmas. And I want to believe that if when these things are done, when we willingly do the very best for society, when we show love and concern, when we live in peace and stability with one another, then society will be better. So Christmas aims at making life better for all and sundry. And for that, I pray and wish that all Christendom, indeed all humanity, will learn to acquire these divine attributes and make our world a better place for all of us to live in.